Hey guys, it's Jacob from My Biohack, and everything is red. What is going on here? No, I don't have a filter on. I actually have a light up there that's red. I've got these red light glasses. I've got a red bulb in there. And that is because it is past sunset. Now, let's talk a little bit about circadian rhythms. Circadian rhythm biology. The science of circadian biology. When the sun is up, you should be awake. And when the sun is down, you should be asleep. So, why do we keep ourselves artificially awake during the night when really there's no biological reason for it? Except for, you know, the emergency reasons needing to get things done and uh, transporting people for emergencies. But other than that, come on. Your biology is not meant for that. <laughs> it's not meant for that at all. And that's because blue light specifically is really toxic because it can cause overstimulation. Blue light is okay during the day when combined with other wavelengths, but when it's solely being portrayed at night, when that's all you're getting, instead of total darkness, you're damaging your eyes. You're messing up your uh, dopaminergic system. You're messing up your whole circadian rhythm. The suprachiasmatic nucleus inside there is becoming messed up. You can also damage your skin. So, what I like to do is, after the sun's gone down, if I'm still up, I use these red lights. Or, if during the day, I'm just being exposed, <laughs> exposed, like explosion, exposed to crappy blue light, then I'll use these wavelengths, which I have 630, 660, and 850, I believe, nanometers, to try to counterbalance the wavelengths. So, another thing that you have to be cautious about, and you can biohack this as well, is if you expose yourself to light during the day and cut out light at night, you can eat pretty much anything during the day. I'm talking about for leptin resistance and weight gain. Now, leptin is this hormone, it's a satiated hormone that tells you to stop eating. And when you uh, are exposed to light, bright light, blue light, that stimulates your suprachiasmatic nucleus and other parts of the reward system in your brain to crave, to get hungry, to produce ghrelin. And if you keep eating past the sunset in the dark and the, you're still being shined with blue light, you're going to become leptin resistant, kind of like how you become insulin resistant. So your leptin receptors don't bind well or pick up and sense that leptin is being secreted. So you're not gonna feel satiated. So what you can do is eat during the day and fast at night. So if it's the summertime and you have longer days, you can eat for longer. And in the wintertime, you eat a little bit less because it's darker for longer. So those are the ways that I biohack red light, blue light, circadian rhythms, at least to feeding cycles and why my setup looks so strange. And these glasses here, these glasses here are actually uh, orange tinted glasses. And then right before bed, about uh, 30 minutes before bed, I'll wear pure red glasses that blocks out both blue and green wavelengths since green can also be stimulating. So I hope this video is useful for you. I hope you enjoyed it along with a few of my errors. And if you did enjoy it, hit that like button. And uh, if you didn't, you know, there's another button for that, but no one likes it. And uh, if this is your first time meeting me, then hit subscribe and you'll be uh, up to date on uh, all the new videos that I'll be putting out soon. So thanks guys. And I'll catch you in the next video.